guys, I'm Sarah from Girls at Scuba. If you haven't heard of Girls at Scuba, we are a female dive community that encourages more women to start scuba diving. Today, I'm here with Simply Scuba to look at female specific BCDs and the different functionalities that make them, you know, different from male BCDs. So the actual main difference between a male and a female designed BCD is the shape that it is made to fit the female body. It's really just those little things that make a big difference when it comes to BCDs. And actually something we're always asked within Girls at Scuba is, when should I start buying my first set of equipment? When should I first start buying my BCD? So we're gonna take a look today at the different types and ranges of BCDs. So hopefully, hopefully you can feel more confident when it comes to buying your first BCD. Okay, so our first BCD is the Aqualung Pearl BCD, which is a really great entry level BCD. If you're looking to buy your first one, this is a really great one for the first BCD. So a few pointers here, which make it really great for the female figure is starting off with the short shoulder straps. So they actually sit a lot higher on your shoulders, a lot more comfortable for the female body. Um, they're adjustable, making, you know, if you are a bit shorter, you can put them higher or lower and they're a lot more comfortable. Um, then going on to the chest strap, uh, that again is a bit higher and you can remove that as well. So if you don't want to wear the chest strap, which actually I don't because I find it quite uncomfortable, you can take that straight off. So going on to the back of the BCD, um, here you can see there is a shorter back plate. So that's actually really good um, to not kind of rest, they will rest comfortably on the small of your back. Um, it's also really great for any smaller scuba divers uh, because that will fit really comfortably for you. Okay, so now going on to the weights. These, as you can see, are integrated weights, which obviously for the female figure are a lot more comfortable because you haven't got that weight belt, you haven't got those lead weights like digging into your hips definitely something that I find a lot more comfortable. I actually cannot wear a weight belt anymore because integrated weights have kind of really changed and how comfortable scuba diving is for me. So I really, really like that about the Aqualung Pearl and all of the female BCDs actually. So something I personally really like about the Aqualung Pearl BCD is the purple trim. I think it really helps you stand out in a subtle way in the boring black scuba diving world of scuba diving equipment. So really nice to just have something a little bit different. Um, a great thing that Aqualung are also doing with this BCD is donating a portion of the proceeds to breast cancer awareness. Now we are on to the Cressy Ultralight. And actually this is the current BCD that I wear. And um, the thing I absolutely love about it is how small and compact you can actually get it to. Um, you can actually fit this in a backpack and obviously in your suitcase as well. And for someone like me who actually doesn't dive in the UK and only dives abroad, this is probably my most essential part of my scuba kit. So already loving the Cressy Ultralight. Uh, another few great things about it is the adjustable chest strap. So there's actually three points there. You can see you can really change that around, make it completely comfortable for you. And again, completely remove it if you wanted to. Um, so it's actually a wing style BCD, as you can see here. These are the wings. So what that means is that it only inflates behind you. This really great part of that is that when you're on the surface, for instance, and you're fully inflated, it's not gonna dig into you and it's a lot more comfortable. Again, you've got the integrated weights, as we said before, again, down to being a lot more comfortable without having the weight belt. Um, all around a really great BCD, perfect for traveling and another entry level BCD that you could consider as your first one. So now we're on to the Scuba Pro Hydros Pro, which is a higher end BCD. Great thing about this is it's monoprene construction, which are these straps here, which means it will stick um, a lot easier to your skin. It will stop it rolling about and it dries instantly. So which is really great for those last days of diving when you're on holiday. These shoulder straps actually have a kit up mode. So they always stay up, which means it's a lot easier for you to kit up. You're not gonna to have to reach behind you trying to find your strap. You're not gonna need your buddy to help you. That is something that is really great about this BCD. So actually the main difference between the male and the female Hydros Pro is the back plate is a little bit shorter. It's also got a little hint of pink there, which brightens up your BCD. 
So again, we have got the integrated weight pockets. Uh, these ones are adjustable and actually removable if you don't get on with the integrated weights. Um, also, you can change the colours of this, so you can remove these colour kits and you can change them to match your fins or whatever favourite colour you want. So you might want a pink or a purple, anything else you can do, again, to brighten up your BCD. With this chest strap, it is adjustable and removable. There are actually three points that you can change it to, so whatever feels comfortable for you, make sure you put that on and remove it if you really don't feel comfortable with that at all. Overall, the Hydros Pro is a really robust BCD, a little bit to the higher range, but if you're getting a lot of scuba diving in, a lot of traveling in, this could be your one. Okay, so that was just a few women BCDs, and you can find all of those at Simply Scuba website, simplyscuba.com, and you can find out more about Girls at Scuba at girlsatscuba.com, and we also have a private female-only Facebook page where you can come and ask us any questions about anything female-specific or anything scuba diving, anything at all, we're gonna link that back down here for you. See you later, guys.